Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Alpha Central, I'm your host Jack, and today we're taking a look at toxic OnlyFans girls getting exposed. But let's jump right in, right after you subscribe, of course. Disclaimer, this video was made for strictly comedic slash artistic purposes. No offense is intended towards any individual featured in this video. But that bass drop? You don't deserve him. What's your type? A guy that watches football, drinks beer, and forgets about your birthday? She's acting like nobody has their own hobbies. He just wanted to show his skill, but she had to make fun of it. So messed up. If you had 15 minutes with me, what would you do? Well, all we need is really five minutes, and I can make you the best damn cheeseburger you've ever had in Miami. Five Sounds minutes? Good. Sure. We're... Come to the menu Miami. Come to the menu Miami. Clock's ticking. Just under four minutes and 37 seconds. <laughs> How is it? So good. So good. So good. <laughs> well, looks like this guy wanted to do a promo for his famous hamburgers. Women have accounts. Yeah, why not? I think that women are like coming more into their own shells and just doing their own thing and not really worrying about what other people have to say about it. So you maybe think it creates more independent women? Absolutely. What do you have to say to the opposition? Mind your own business. <laughs> women are evolving. We're becoming our own individual person and not really caring what men have to say about us anymore. Yeah, women can do whatever they want, but that doesn't mean every guy is gonna want it. Here's something to always remember. Mariah Carey sued her ex-husband for wasting her time. And she won. Just because your favorite celebrity can do anything doesn't mean we all can. When did time begin? Ooh, we don't know! She isn't real. We don't know. And she's my ass. Satan definitely real. And I think hey, the earth began you? with science. It started when they hit a start. To be honest, I have no idea what these girls are trying to say or get across here. What's the best way to get out of a date before it happens? We're actually part of the Dead Mom Club, so um, I would blame it on that. Are you guys moms? No, all of our moms are dead. <laughs> I honestly didn't hear that one. Who cares? Y'all, I'm so sorry about that one. I really don't give a sh Bring it in for a group hug. Well, rest in peace to their mothers, but using this as a way to get out of a date does not make sense. Hi guys, it's me again, the girl you all love to hate. Today, I'm going to do a stretching video so I can show you the outline of my punch kebab. I always tell people that I'll never get an OnlyFans, but what I don't realize is that my entire Instagram feed is basically a free OnlyFans because I'm always showing off this fat. And I judge girls that have OnlyFans and also call out dudes who stare at me at the gym, even though I secretly love the attention. Now, if you could all please like and comment on this thirst trap video of me, I'd be grateful. See you next time. Pretty much what she's saying is that female fitness influencers love the attention. You have a boyfriend. Yes. Do you have a boy best friend? Also. Oh, is he okay with that? Sure. If you were to call up your boy best friend and ask him to Netflix and chill, would he do it? I don't think so. We're just friends. That, that might be weird. Do you want to test it? Okay, let's try. <laughs> okay, call him up, call him up. Put on speaker. Hello. How's it going? Everything good. What about you? Just chilling. What are you doing later? I might be busy. You might coming over? Why? I don't know. Maybe just watch a movie. What do you think about that? Why are you <laughs> thinking about it? I saw something of yours online. I saw your underwear online. You were selling it. Bruh. I made 10k last month, so what's the problem? 10k? Oh. You know, on a place called Sophia Gray. Oh, I mean, well, maybe I am free later. Oh, you only want me from the money now? No. Just be just honest. No, 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 not, not just for the money. I, I like you as well, and I actually had a crush on you for a long time. Oh, no, you like me. Um, He's only doing it for the money. I'm not sure about that. 9 p.m., I'll bring the snacks. No way, you jerk. Oh, you sent the call. <laughs> Wait, you actually made 10k last month from selling underwear? Sure. Wait, what? Where? Sophia Gray. Damn, that's a finesse. If this doesn't show the guy best friend true motto, I don't know what does. Worst part is, the woman will blame the man for getting jealous. Would you smash on the first date? Like, typically. These are my work colleagues now. Oh. Okay. Keep it, keep, keep it, it clean. Okay. Asking him that in front of his own work colleagues is out of this world. <laughs> I don't even know how to react. How is this even possible? What is one thing that you've never told your ex? We were arguing and I put his toothbrush and my pee in the toilet and I just scrubbed the <gasps> toilet. Off and I watched him brush his teeth in the <gasps> He was like, did Colgate come out with a new flavor or? Okay, can you say that? It was very bad. What did he do? It was just a toxic relationship. I was always arguing. Like he'll turn off his location and block me, stuff like that, so I did that. Really had no First of all, this sounds like the most toxic relationship ever. But why would she do that to his toothbrush? That's just too far, man. They are so superficial. Would you date a guy that's shorter than you? Absolutely not. I'd at least 6'2". At least 6'2". Yeah. How tall are you? 5'5". Five, five. 
Five five. Yeah. So six five, two, well, six five, two yeah. bare minimum. Yeah, I just like tall dudes. Nothing wrong with liking tall dudes. Just makes the dating pool slimmer. My girl. Hola. Ooh. What? What's up? Like for real? Yeah, for real. Aaron. For real? What? Like what? Man. It's, it's like a bad movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, just, I I gotta ask, I gotta ask, is that really how you act? Yeah. Yeah. That's really you? Yeah, why does it matter? I'm saying. And this is a woman that you're attracted to? Why that is it your is. business? I love it. That's my girl! My girl! My girl! Right here! Right here! It's my girl! She is! She's Wait, my girl. hold on. I, I just yeah. wanna make sure. It's my okay, girl. First you, of all, hold first on, of all. hold on, hold on. It's my girl. You, I, wanna, I, gotta, I gotta make sure. You, you are a mother, right? Yeah. You're a mother. Yeah. And that's how you act? You come out here and you talk like because that? Because this is like some <laughs> who, who goes on TV and talks about their problems? Like, you. No. <laughs> okay. He's really spitting straight facts here. She was so rude and he wanted to call her out. We want to start a family. family. Um, we want to know our options. And we, we have partners. We share a partner. Are they twins? And we see us having a child Wait, with him. With both of us. Mm. Not just one child, two babies. babies. She needs to be pregnant and I need to be yeah. pregnant at exactly the same time. Are the babies going to be twins she, too? Like, and then 10 minutes after, like what? straight away with Anna. <laughs> Is that possible? <laughs> Please forgive me. Oh my yeah. god. We gave him like a right. And we quickly did the turkey base oh up and quickly <laughs> in her and then me. Is that possible? I suppose oh my god. yes. May work. He looks really disgusting. Bad. So the chance of getting pregnant in every month is about fifteen to twenty five percent rate general. You want it to happen at the same time. Fifteen yeah. percent is about one in six. So oh. two at the same time is about one in thirty six chance good of enough, that's not, not good, good enough, enough for us. Yeah, I'm not we're not gonna accept that. that. Well, I don't know what they expect. <laughs> like what? <laughs> Not only do they want to share a partner, but they have specific wants. Imagine having to deal with all that. Men who are confident don't care what your woman does. As, as long as at the end of the day, you are committed to them, coming back home to them, and doing everything for them at the end of the day. What? Bro, what are you talking about? Let me ask you a question. Between two people, you tell me which one is more confident. Okay. You have one person that, let's say, deep down he feels a certain way or thinks a certain thing, but doesn't tell you at the risk of offending you or the risk of losing you in a relationship, keeps it to himself and allows the relationship to continue, right? Doesn't tell you the boundary or whatever. And you have another man that doesn't like when you're on OnlyFans, doesn't like when you dress a certain way, doesn't like when you do certain things, and he tells you even if it means losing you in the relationship. Between these two people, who is more confident? I think the second one. The second. Got him. If a man that you're dealing with, maybe he's not okay with it, wouldn't that be a sign of confidence by him telling you that he's not okay with it? But it's also a sign of confidence when he says, I'm okay with this and says it. Huh? So have men said that to you before? Yes. Where are they at now? I left. This is in no way a representation of a confident man. There's set boundaries in all relationships. Should women buy men a gift for Valentine's Day? Absolutely. The world has changed, man. We're, it's 50-50 here, right? Matter of fact, here she is. Should women get men something for Valentine's Day? Oh, hell to the no. No? No, no, no. Valentine's Day is an opportunity for men to show how much they love their women. Absolutely. Why wouldn't she buy her man's a Valentine's gift? What do you do for a living? Oh, uh, well, I'm a nurse's assistant. I'm, I'm studying to be a nurse. I want to be a doctor when I get a bit older, but it's going to take like four or five more years of school. So I'm studying hard and really just trying to get my grades up. Um, what about you? I do OF. O F. What do you post on there? Oh, my. Well. My father would not be proud. Mine isn't either. The reaction he showed when she said she does OnlyFans is golden. I'm talking about when a guy's done a where? Where, where, you, does where, he, where does he put oh, it at? Oh well, only only boyfriends and husbands and you. Okay. Boyfriends is a maybe. <laughs> but aren't you scared of? That's, that's why they make medication and, and it's hashtag pro-choice. Don't get it twisted. If it's your boyfriend, can, can he leave it in if your mouth? If it's my boyfriend, yeah, he can leave it in my mouth. 
Where do you want him to leave it at, though? Honestly, easiest cleanup is, like, down the chest. But, like, what's hot is, like... But hot is, like, on my face and my mouth. Yeah. Sensational. All I have to say is, her boyfriend better run. Now. Did you rather date a nice guy or... I like talk so... Toxic? Why? I don't know, it's fun. You want them to call you like, your head looks like a cantaloupe. <laughs> <laughs> Not like that! It's <laughs> just <laughs> like a cantaloupe. Funner! Like, it's a little bit of spice in the relationship. Hey. Alright boys, so you know the drill. Stay toxic, my friends. How tall are you? I'm five nine and a half. Okay, can you hold this? <laughs> okay, stand up straight. Okay. Five ten. I'm five ten. That's good. But not accounting for shoes, so yeah, probably five and a half. I'm accurate. I'm six foot, but I think I slouch because I sit at a computer all day. I think people think I'm 5'11 because of that. Yeah, that happens if you sit. So you also sit at a computer all day. But I like working out and running, so that kind of oh, helps good. me stay in shape. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's what's this? Well, how tall are you? That's the only question I'm not asked. I'm uh, 17 centimeters. What is that in America? 17 inches! Because I'm long, but I'm short, and I'm stumpy like a stump. You scared? I'll bite. You know I'll bite. I'm, I'm checking. I think I'm, I think I'm three, three, eight. Three, one. Ooh, I grew. Yeah. So, like, would you, like, pick me up? What if I, like, grab you like this? <clears throat> That's pretty good. That's, like, every ounce of power I have because I don't work out. Do you want me to go on my knees again? <laughs> Probably not here. Why is she even doing this in the background? Pretty creepy if you ask me. It's a reputable job. I think so. I mean, I don't think it's a crime. Okay. Or something to be shame ashamed of. Is it okay to date someone who does Sure. Okay. And you think they could have a live a normal relationship just fine? I think so. What do you have to say to the people who th says they can't? I'm religious too. Yeah, have your own opinion. If you don't want to date a model, then don't. It really boils down to how the man feels. I mean, some men would love to have a lady who does OF. Others will despise it. What's your most embarrassing story? I was hooking up with my ex-boyfriend, and I'm just running through the script. Okay. And I'm like, oh my god, big, little, tiny. He stops, and I'm like, sorry, man, I'm so sorry. It was kind of over at that point. That's really just the rudest thing you can say. Good thing he dropped her after that, though. You guys date a girl that has an Absolutely not. I'm not the only one that gets to see what I'm seeing. I want the value of that is mine. But what if she's just doing it for money, though? I'll provide for her. Hair, nails, everything. Everything. But I think that's overrated nowadays. Their nails are this long. 20 years from now, this can be this long. I'll pay for it. But you got to set the girl's expectations right. These girls' expectations, they got to have everything done once a week. I mean, come on. Let the guy breathe a little. Period. This guy is just spitting facts. He's exposing the whole darn OF industry. And how everything is going, I think the expectation for a man are getting higher and higher. Especially with what they can bring to the table in terms of money. There needs to be a point where enough is enough. Anyways, what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. You guys have made it to the end. Like and subscribe to prove you're an alpha. And remember, according to YouTube, the best way to help the channel and the algorithm is to watch another one of my videos right after this video. So if you like this video, you should watch another one. Till next time.